Hey, what's up guys? Spork here back with another video, this time on improving your frame rates using DLSS 4, the new technology from NVIDIA. So first and foremost, what is DLSS 4? Well, DLSS 4, short answer is, it uses AI cores that are already in your GPU to improve your frame rates by generating some additional frames in between as motion occurs as it upscales the image. In normal words, it just means your game runs better and it feels better as you play it. Now, if anyone's actually interested on the full post from NVIDIA on exactly what DLSS 4 is and all the technology behind it, I'll leave that linked down in the description below. That way, anyone who really wants to read that stuff, you know, the super nerdy nitty gritty of exactly how it works, you can go ahead and read that below. So before we get started, just a quick disclaimer here, you do have to be running an NVIDIA GPU. You cannot run this on an AMD or Intel GPU. They each have their own technologies that are completely separate from this. One thing to note, I am also running this on an RTX 3080. I am a couple of generations behind. DLSS 4.0 does run on, I believe, 2000 series and up GPUs. So what you're going to do is first open the NVIDIA app. Now, most of you should already have this app installed. It is installed by default when you install your graphics drive. Once you open this app, you're going to go ahead and head over to the graphics tab. And then once you're on the graphics tab, you're going to choose escape from Tarkov from the programs that are installed. If you don't have it in that list, there is an option for NVIDIA to scan your game files and try to find the games that are installed. And then Tarkov will show up in this list. But once you have it in the list, go ahead and select it. Scroll down to the section that says driver settings. In this section, you're looking for the DLSS override model presets option. Then you're going to select this, select use different settings for each DLSS technology, and then super resolution, change that to latest. Once you hit apply, that's it. Now Tarkov will run using DLSS 4.0. Now what you'll see here is in my app specifically, it does actually gray out the option and say unsupported. If you see this in your NVIDIA app, all you have to do is just jump into control panel or settings, uninstall that app, and then reinstall it. I'll link that download in the description so you can grab it if you either don't have this app or if you do need to reinstall it for the unsupported grayed out issue. Now, just a quick few cents on my opinion of this technology. Personally, I feel like Escape from Tarkov is more responsive and looks better using these settings. I'm going to leave a couple of clips here of with and without DLSS. Um, personally, I feel like the foliage doesn't glue glimmer as much or shimmer as much. Um, you can also see, I'm going to zoom in on this one, the far away details sometimes almost lose their lose their shapes or lose their details. I've got a clip of it here. Personally, I just think everything looks better and runs better with DLSS and the game feels more responsive as a whole. I went ahead and filmed these on customs, which I know since the update has been one of the hardest maps for some people to run. Hopefully this helps you get some more frame rates out of it and enjoy playing the game again. Huge shout out to accomplished rip 4871 on the subreddit. I'm going to leave the link to the original post here. He has a lot of details as well as some additional videos screenshots and thoughts on exactly what DLSS has. Uh, feel free to jump in the discussion there, share your own opinions, thoughts, leave a comment, like, and subscribe if you like these kinds of tutorials. And if you want to see more optimizations, enhancements, or things you can do to run Tarkov better on your computer. 